All right. Well, guys, welcome back to Smash University, and we got a another another quality set coming on. Of course, you got Sora. You hear the music? You already know we are going to the Kingdom Hearts Smash Ultimate Edition. And of course, I'm joined here by my boy Charles. What up, baby? It's time, man. Time. Unlock the, the most keys. requested character in the entire Smash series is here, Sora. All right. Obviously, we have we have to bring you guys some of the uh, the sick matchups, of course, the lore matchups, right? You know, Sora yep. does have to uh, defeat Sephiroth in Kingdom Hearts One and Two, uh, known as one of the harder bosses. But we'll see if uh, see if uh, Nairo can be the boss here with the with the Sephiroth. Now, I feel like Sephiroth could do a lot of work here against Sora, just because you know Sora is essentially a sword character, but Sephiroth. Sword is a little bit bigger. Yep, uh, he's always been actually traditionally good against sword characters, right? Because he's just got that extra range. I mean, look at the damage already on here. My boy is on hard mode, dude. Like he is going <laughs> in. Of course, uh, guys, you are looking at a Nairo, one of the best ever. Do it, beautiful up air catch on that that juggle situation there. And of course, you got Void, man, one with the Sora. So these these are pros going at it in Kingdom Hearts, man. I love it. Now my thing too is like. I feel like even when Sephiroth's juggle, um, you know, juggles Sora, Sora is so floaty, and yep. you you just feel like you're in the air forever. So honestly, I I feel like Sephiroth is gonna be like the the up air, the IDJ up air after the up throw is gonna be really strong. And oh my oh, goodness, the no, shield that break! Is your soul to oh. despair. <laughs> Goodbye. Didn't even need the neutral B just going up for a charge up smash. All right, we got the transformation coming Yo, through. This is actually fire. This is the first time I've seen the transformation. Oh, dude, it's so nice. All right, so oh, yeah. Void finally going to pick up the stock here, confirming into the up B, which you can do from, like, the fair and the nair. So uh, pretty yep. solid confirms. But right now, honestly, just Void just having struggles getting in here on Sephiroth. And, I mean, obviously the shield break, too. Nairo is getting a lot of early kills here. Oh, my oh God. My God. Oh, my <laughs> Yo, <laughs> Yo. Yo. <laughs> yeah, Nibelheim is gone. <laughs> oh no! Went. Oh my goodness! Nairo weaving right underneath both of the fire fireagas there, and just slapping it with the backer. You you hit a backer that deep off stage. Oh man, I I don't care how many friends you got, Sora. You're done. Oh yeah, you're definitely done, bro. Fall into darkness, son. <laughs> like, <laughs> come back next time. Dude. Wow. Okay. So that, we're, yeah, we're obviously gonna play all the matches on um, the new stage hall, um, hall of Bastion, I think. Yeah. Hall yep. Hall of Bastion. Yeah, absolutely. So I wonder music. if Wayne can actually like use some more of the spells, kind of play more of that zoner type game. I, I know like, mm -hmm. Sephiroth does have the neutral B, but it's not like the greatest projectile, right? Yeah. Yeah. No. Absolutely. Uh, but I mean, again, one of the things though. Um, like you are gonna have that shadow flare that's really good in, in like just anti zoning tool, right? So it'll deal with the fire guy really well. Uh, Thundaga is also gonna be a big tool for him. One of the biggest things for Sora that's gonna be a problem is dealing with the buttons because even the frame data that Sora does have is comparable to Sephiroth. And of course, as we talked about before, Sephiroth's gonna have more range there, so it's gonna be really hard to, for Sora to get something going. But given Sephiroth's hurt box. Uh, his combos are insane on Sephiroth. It's very easy to get the uh, fair two chains, getting some of the nair loops too, and converting that into some good damage. But wow, what a kill right there from Nairo. Yeah, and it's it's like, you know, especially with all the IDJ fair stuff, those are going to be the main things. Okay, going to get no double jump here, but the wing, the recovery, and man, that, nice. that thunder not fully connecting, that's something I did notice. If you DI down on that first hit of the thunder, usually the rest of it doesn't connect. Yep. See, goes for dash attack. Fairly fast move. Oh, kind of faded back. Tried to be a little bit too safe with that fair. I'm pretty sure that would have taken the stock. Yeah, I wonder if uh, Void could also start, uh, you know, countering that recovery from Sephiroth. Now we're going to be yep. going a little too hard off stage. So two stocks apiece here. Thunder on deck, but Nairo just keeping the pressure off stage. And yeah, I mean, it, Nairo, even even if he doesn't necessarily get the stock off stage, he's getting a lot of damage. Oh, absolutely. And you know what's the funniest thing is, like, of course, we are, uh, you hear about Sora <laughs> being the king, right? Right? Yo! Oh, Respect! My... 
My soul. Oh man, he's so floaty. He can't. He. So nope. what do you do in that situation? You have to air dodge yeah. the up air, right? Like your move yeah. doesn't come out fast enough. But then, yeah. so then you, because you can't double jump. Your double jump's too slow. And this is where Sora. We're kind of seeing some of the weaknesses for Sora kind of be unveiled here in terms of just like, mm -hmm. you know, your double jump. If your double jump has a lot of startup, you can't double jump out of combos, right? Yeah. Because you're just kind of sitting there. So now you're kind of forcing these weird like situations where like, okay, why well, air dodge, but. You know, I don't really go anywhere because I'm a floaty. Yeah. No, that, that's going to be one of the most dangerous things. Great up B there to close the stock. And yeah, Sora's going to, ironically, uh, being so great in the air, he has trouble getting going down, like you said. And it's going to be, Sephiroth is going to be one of the biggest benefactors of that. And even when it comes to edge guarding him in general, Sephiroth's going to be pretty good. We talk about Sora being an excellent edge guarder. Sephiroth 2 is one of the best edge guards in the game. It's like absolutely insane when off stage. Right, fair off stage, especially with mm -hmm. counter as well. Both these characters have great counters for edge guarding here. Void using the magic to stall. Narrow setting up the forward air. We're kind of just rotating through the spells. The side B goes away, tries to go up and over, and that is going to oh. be the song. Very smart from Nairo there. Just going yeah. off to the side and getting that win. Yeah, brilliant stuff there. And Sephiroth once again going to take it. Yeah, it's going to be hard, right? Because uh, Void, you can see he's kind of sit back trying to dissect how he can get his in. But the pace is really dictated there by Nairo. Uh, just like, you know, Nairo, you know how he is. He loves the pressure of his aggression. But he's also standing in that perfect range where it's just really hard for uh, Void to kind of get in and get anything started. Yeah, even like, especially when... You know, Nairo's able to kind of stand by the edge of the stage and throw out some of these backers when Void is off stage. I, it just Sora doesn't have the speed to come in and whiff punish. So, okay, here's the down air. Yeah, trying to get the early stalk here. Gonna be able to go into another up B side B yep. counter. Oh, okay, wow. Oh no. Interrupting. Yeah, I mean that it, it Sora can get some crazy reversals off stage. Yep. Um, especially with counter uh, sniping double jumps. Oh, tries oh, to go for the up upbeat. Yeah, why not? Yeah. Why not? Yeah, I respect it. Yeah, and you and the thing is, you can just side be back high onto the stage here. Here's the yeah. orb set up here for Nairo, though. Oh, oh and you gotta hold this. Yeah, we are dead. Oh my! Wow, using using the shadow orbs to actually finish the edge guard and have that finish the edge edge guard. Very offensive way to use the. Uh, the orbs there. You see most players kind of go for a set play scenario, try to lock their opponent right. down. But yeah. no, not Nairo. Nairo's like, oh, actually, yeah. I'm going to use that as the kill move. <laughs> yep. <laughs> that, <laughs> I'm that's the last hit of the combo, you. actually. <laughs> exactly. And again, going back to what you were talking about before, where Sora's going to be floaty. So, and you uh, Savoy understood that, right? Oh my gosh, that's so close for a kill. Yeah. And, and you get see up air. Void trying to wait this out, trying to get past the up air. Yeah, and just look at the coverage of that platform. Good to We got one wing on deck. You already know what that means. Got to get out of here as soon as possible. I don't got to interact with you, Sora. See ya. Nope. <laughs> I'm, I'm already over here back air. <laughs> Where are you at? That, oh, up angled F2. I like it. Look at all. You know the up airs? You have to respect that space. Yeah, Sephiroth's reverse up air is looking crazy right now. Trying to use the magic by the edge here. So much utility, yes. especially trying to drop the thunder right for that two-frame angle. Very strong. Yeah. I actually think he could have comboed from that trade into up B um, oh. instead of trying to go for a pair. But now we have a huge problem here. What are you going to do? Okay, tries to get the two-frame here. Wow, this, the bottom of the stage is clear too. Man, this stage looks yep. so beautiful. Oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, and, uh, yep, 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 why not? <laughs> why not? Why not? Why not? Going underneath the thunder with the up B. Man, Nairo is so offensive with these special moves, man. It's so fun to watch. And God dang. Sora, not even. Sorry, man. Not even getting a game off young Seth. <laughs> Seth said, man, <laughs> you're going to be in my memories, bro. <laughs> dang. <laughs> All right, well, that was really fun sets. We're going to have more sets coming up for you guys. Uh, just, you know, getting all this Sora hype. We really want to see how the character plays at top level. So we're trying to, you know, go ahead and get bring that to you guys. If you guys did enjoy the exhibition match, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.